Alright, hey everyone, this is AirsoftBuddy83. Uh, it's my first video, so don't really put any harsh comments, please. Uh, uh, I'm just kind of showing you how to fix an Echo 1 magazine if it breaks, because on mine, there's a little shaft down there. I don't know if you can see it, but it's in between the coiled spring. That little middle pole right there has two edges on it, or two slots is a better word, that hold the... Uh, you can't see that, I know. But it's got the, it holds the little spring in there, and that's what creates tension to spring the gears. This one right here, this is what was on there, snapped off. So right now I'm going to tell you how to fix it. Basically, what I did is, because I know you can't see the middle, is I made a bigger diagram. There's the coiled spring, which is this piece right here. And it fits into the slot between the gear hub, as I call it, and the gear shaft. And there's another one over here, which mine broke, so... Basically, what I did is you put the spring in one of these gear hubs, or the slot between the gear hub and the shaft, and you put it in there, and you mix up epoxy, and you glue it in there. Epoxy is a really strong glue. It looks like that. kind of looks like animal barf, I guess, if you want to play it that way. But if I can get a uh, magnifying glass, and I can show you how it works. So, hold on. Alright, sorry about that weight, but if you can see it, there it is. That's the little shaft right there. And there's epoxy inside of it. So, it's pretty, it's actually a pretty good design. It's been working so far, and I think it'll hold up pretty well. So, and then now, if you, pretty much when your mag breaks, look for that. And then, if it's not that problem, you're kind of on your own, because it's, the only thing I've encountered so far, so. And now if if you just needed to find out how to fix your mag and you know where all these like little gears and stuff like the internals go, I'd recommend stop watching because now this is just a uh, replacement video, I guess, if you need to find out where everything goes. So, right in this slot right here, the, um, uh, you probably can't see this, but... This right here that my pen is in front of is the little spring for the catch. It's right there. Um, there's this little black lever here. Kind of looks like uh, an armchair. You just got to fiddle with it and it'll go in there right. And then, that's basically it. I'll see if I can zoom. First time using this camera too, so. And I'm too lazy to find out how to zoom. And then... Let you see that for a few minutes. If you need to pause this video while you get everything back in place, I recommend doing that. So here's just the BB shaft that they travel up. And now this is with the big gears. So there's two gears pretty much of the same size. One of them is a little smaller. There's a big one right here. And then off to the right there's a small one. The big one goes in front. And the smaller one's right there. And then up here, there's a little metal rod with a golden gear on it. That's where it goes if you lost it. And then right here, I hope you can ah, right here, you can take this thing off. And then there's this gear on here. It's a thickest gear, and it's got the little... I don't know what it is. It's like the thing that they used to summon the Kraken and Pirates of the Caribbean. If you've seen that movie, great movie by the way. I like it. Five stars. And then I can't even see this. Well, yeah, I can, but. And then right here, there's the resistance to the coil, this big main winding coil. Here's the spring right here that adds resistance. You gotta fit it in there right, so it goes. You'll find when you take it out. Yeah, I'll drop it for you real quick. Yeah. You'll find when you take it out. It's got, it looks like that pretty much, and what, basically when you put it in, this end right here has to be, that little end has to be up against one of these little knobs in the winding wheel, and then the other one just kind of falls into place, so. Well, if that's the problem with your mag, glad I could help, but um, if it's not, I 
guess. You're on your own. Bye.